At a recent House hearing on Next Generation 911 Communications, Congressman Fry of South Carolina asked Dr. Brian Fontes, former CEO of the National Emergency Number Association, how artificial intelligence will play a role in the new emergency communication system. We frequently discuss AI and its potential uh, impact on this committee. Uh, emergency communications are no different. Uh, AI will change the game. Dr. Fontes, you also note that next generation 911 will allow Americans to send texts, images, videos, uh, and other forms of data directly to call centers. Uh, data that could be enhanced or triaged through AI tools. How do you see AI shaping the effectiveness of next generation 911 in practice? And what safeguards should Congress consider uh, to ensure that this technology strengthens rather than complicates the emergency response system? Thank you for your question. And AI is beginning to uh, enter into the 911 space. In the next generation 911 environment, when data are allowed to come into 911 centers, videos, et cetera, the use of AI, as I would envision it, would allow us to either have supporting tools that may hear or see something that the human ear or eye cannot see or hear. And so, therefore, it may provide more correct uh, situational uh, issues, enabling the field responders to know what they're going into when they respond to that emergency. I think there's also a variety of opportunities dealing with language translations, transcripts, record maintenance in the backroom aspects of next generation or 911 systems at large. But you need that next generation 911 system to have that data flow into the 911 centers. So that is one of the fundamental aspects I believe is critical, critical to the use of advanced technologies like AI in serving the best possible 911 service to the public. For more congressional news, stay tuned to Congress Clips and thanks for watching.